Thank you guys for showing up and tuning in. Uh, we're going to go ahead and focus on Uncle Chell today. Okay, now I'm saying his real name because I'm being serious. Um, I just watched this video about Jamal Hill. You guys probably did as well. If not, go check that out. But <clears throat> um, we're going to start talking and get more into detail about why he is unhealthy and what we need to do. Like We have a responsibility uh, to not go in circles or not mess around too much with this so that way we can get to the root cause and hopefully help him. Now, the goal is to make Chell hear us, okay? Otherwise, we will lose a great. I earlier poked a little bit of fun. I was, I was just coming out of the, the desert. Uh, he makes himself such an easy target. Uh, that's why we had to poke fun, but that is part of the healing process. Now, in this process, we can also heal and be better for ourselves and help one another. Uh, for example, we're going to give a little bit of an acknowledgement to some of the commenter, uh, commenters uh, that's helped out. O-A-W, I think is the, the call letters there. But um, you guys, when you comment and let me know thoughts, you can actually help this process. What we're trying to do is allow us to be without fear of judgment. Yes, there, we're saying it, we're on the right track. Now, as fruity as that sounds, uh, Uncle Chell was talking all about fruits. He had lemons in there, he had grapevines, um, you know, he was talking about a, a vernacular, and yes, there is a vernacular, but I'm more concerned about his vascular, okay? Uh, the vernacular of his ve ve vascular, the vascular of the vernacular, is that he is unwell. Now, it's not the reason that you think it is, and I'm glad that he did a 12 minute and 26 second video. Uh, the reason I'm happy about that is it gives me time to be a little bit more long-winded uh, because I have a lot to say, and I know that sometimes I beat around the bush and I don't get there. Well, let's think of it like the news. Just put me on in the background, and listen, and then you will hear the parts that resonate with you. And that is key to this process. Now, if I get to the video soon enough with Uncle Chell, then I can come in at the same time frame. Now, it doesn't have to be exact, but I try to get it exactly. Uh, otherwise, if I'm a little delayed, we need for it to look like a, a glitch. Like, what is going on? We need to get Chell to look at the channel and think, well, I don't know, is this is this mine? or Because I get confused sometimes when I look at his. I think I'm on mine. But that is the intent here, okay? And intent is a very good word. I may go ahead and put that at the beginning because the intention here is to help not only Chell, but us and, and myself. I will, I will not... Um, I will not be afraid to say that I'm trying to help myself, um, but it is about everyone else and I do want to help Chell. Now, we're going to get right to it. Um, if you've ever heard the experts will tell you, um, they will, will talk about things like they know, but they don't really know, right? They're just, they're just telling you they're experts, so what do, what do we know? But if i just changed positions a little bit it is the stress level of what he's doing think about it he got inducted into the hall of fame guys okay on saturday night he had all the buzz from all that energy uh, all those dopamine spikes it was just ah uh, he took one day he took one day for himself herein lies the issue and problem i'm not saying that he shouldn't have took one day I'm not saying that he should take more. I'm saying that he has been operating at such a high level for such a long time. It is taking a toll. He needs to start thinking about exit strategies. Now, he's been very fortunate and he is in that position where he can. And we're going to touch a little bit on Chell's history. And if you haven't paid attention or you don't know well enough then you know that he holds 
and absolutely chill. The last thing I want is the American gangster mad at me uh, or coming and look for me. So this is a no disrespect whatsoever. Do not take it out of context. But his father plays a heavy role on him. Now, I was a little... I've been, a little, I've been searching a little. Uh, I know where we're going. You know, we're we're. I know where the where we are, like there. Uh, and as I'm doing that, go ahead, push all the little buttons. Okay, you push the button. It's like this, and if you get lost, then you do that one. Right, it goes backwards if you just drag it a little bit. Um, but that is for chill. If we do that. Okay, if we push the buttons, it's for Chell so he can get the message, but it's more than for Chell. It is for us, okay? It's for us. Um, we'll give a really quick moment before we kind of get into the details about Chell's stress and where he's headed and what his expectations are, like we all have of ourselves, and we just keep going and going. Quick little reminder about lettucehands.org. Yes, you can go over there and you can get your dogs registered. Why would you ever need to register your hands at lettucehands.org? Well, if you've ever been out to eat and you've been sitting there shoveling food in your mouth with these utensils and you've thought to yourself, I have God given built in utensils right here. I will just use my hands. If you go over to lettucehands.org, Pick the Venmo app. You just send me money. It does not matter how much it is, as long as it's between $21.99 and $99.99, then I will register for you your hands at lettucehands.org and it will be held in the nationwide, official, worldwide federation registry of lettucehands.org. And you will be able to go to any establishment. I'm talking any establishment, guys. Any establishment in the world. Not only on top of it, but in it. Like inside of it. And they will not even question. You will be able to use your God-given utensils. Get on over there and take care of that. Okay? Thank you. So, we were on the subject of... Now, I need you to watch me when I do this, okay? Because it's going to be quick. Now, when I do it, I don't want to settle too long on this because I need to glance over it. This is going to be a very repetitive message. It's going to be in all these videos. Now, he's a little stressed, dude, okay? And it's because from childhood, he had all these expectations, all this building up, all this busy regimen. He, he, was, a, he was a champion, or was he a champion? I'm not really sure. But if he wants to break the cycle and not do the same and have his son feel the same, it's not a guilt that he feels. There's a pride with, with Chell, but there, there is, there's something there. He needs to break this cycle so that way he can. I had to look out that way because some action was happening. I'm like, what, what, what's the action? What action, bro? What we get over there? So, uh, but if he wants to break the cycle, then he really needs to start looking and thinking about an exit. Now he did six videos. Okay. We counted it earlier. I'm saying it again. You could always go backwards. He did six videos on a Monday after he took one day rest of getting the acknowledgement of being inducted into the UFC MMA Hall of Fame. Uh, he might as well just registered over at lettucehands.org because that's how serious he needs to take that. Okay? It does feel good to be acknowledged, though. So kudos. Good, good job. Good uh, job. But his family and... He does a lot with all the kids, you know, with like wrestling programs. He really loves it. Now, you would think he's doing what he loves, and he is. Now, he just got on the ESPN with DC, and it's showing that fractured cerebral, right? It's showing the glimpse of that. Now, what's going to end up happening, you can say, you can say that you heard it here first, okay? He will depart early and suddenly if, he does not change things. Now, we see how much he works out. 
I work out. I have a great little uh, morning routine. I don't work out a whole lot. I'm not going to focus on that. There's not really any kind of a chance that I'm going to need to be crazy in shape or run from something or beat something up. Um, now, if I remember correctly and, and you're watching, if you go back and watch it, okay, then you will see that, what is the vernacular here? Hmm. Pretty sure no one's going to see this part of the video. I can just... Do I got something in there? Well, you know what, guys? Now my bottom teeth, they're kind of jacked up, aren't they? Kind of crazy, how bottom ones. Yeah, that one ever goes in, and this one kind of in too, and they're really tight. Like it's hard to floss them. Really is. And just brush my teeth too. I was eating like so nuts, and I had it in here. I was afraid you guys are gonna see them, but I think I got it. I think I got a real good. I always wonder what that thing is. What is that? Are you guys seeing? Like, what do you think that is? Does it have an antenna? Is it like some weird ladybug? Not too sure who drew that one, but. Moral of the story is, guys, and this is why you tuned in. That's why I'm coming back, okay? I'm coming right back. Do not take yourself too seriously. Do not be afraid of being judged or just being you. But also know when to call it. I'm not sure that Chell knows when to call it. Okay. I'm not sure, but if we, and I'm asking, okay, I'm not too good to ask. I'm, I'm asking, please, let's get the message to chill. We need to, he needs it, but more importantly, we can improve. 